period pain and it is in medical terms it is called dysmenorrhea it is a very common problem that most of the females undergo so what all to do when you are having period pain that is the biggest question first and foremost you can try some things that are available in the house like you can uh, do some massage in the area if you are having excessive pain you can use different kind of massage oils that are soothing and you can do some light exercise it's not necessary that you keep on lying down during your periods light exercise is good for the periods you can do but you cannot lift heavy weight during the period secondly you can take some herbal teas that is soothing so that will relieve your stress it is a mind de-stressing thing and if your mind is relieved many times your pain it goes off like that only fourthly you can take some heat therapies like you must have heard uh, like our grandmothers used to say that you can use some hot water bottle or hot waters or those compression in those area it is totally safe but that water has to be lukewarm it cannot be very hot so be aware that you don't get burned because of that the hydration has to be maintained a good hydration has to be maintained means the water intake in your body has to be sufficient these also relieve your period pain because there is a lot of progesterone congestion during this time and if you take a lot of water it gets flushed out and subsequently your period pain subsides so the massage is also important because what happens the your muscles keep on contracting and relaxing during your period pain there is a definitely a role of massage during this time thirdly comes that you can take some medications so what medications to take for that you should see your gynecologist who will be guiding you that what are the best medications please don't take any medications on your own because all these over the counter painkillers that are available they do have their own side effects and it's very necessary to know that what is the problem and if these things are also not relieving you then we need to make a diagnosis whether this dysmenorrhea means this period pain is pathological or not because in a few patients this period pain is not physiological means it is not normal it is pathological and this things can relieve the pain which is physiological but it cannot relieve the pain that is pathological for that we have to give you hormonal medications so everything that you are doing you have to take a proper guidance of your gynecologist and you should visit your doctor and you should take your daughters who so ever mothers are watching it if the patient is watching it herself you should definitely come and see your doctor it is not a thing like okay period pain is happening so let us happen so please follow all this and you will be like pain free or at least you will be able to do all your day to day activities you will be like a normal female like the non period dates so don't be very much stressed out if you are having periods periods is a very normal thing that happens to all the females and believe me it shows that you are fertile so be happy we care about you